back to school party. Thank you so much. The kids get a chance to learn about any topics they want. Mm -hmm. There's yeah. also a public speaking component. So Ooh, we teach kids how okay. to make a speech, give a speech, Ooh, and feel cool. comfortable. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Life but skills. It, but Life skills. the venue is local or? Yes, this is here, all in Just here in yep. Okay. It's in Yep, yep. <laughs> and the name is 4-H Manitoba. Manitoba and we are the Nipua Bells, Bells, Bells and Builders. And Builders. Yes. Thank you. We're here with Cindy Price of uh, Special Olympics Manitoba. So yeah, Cindy, could, can you tell us something about the organization that you have yeah, and what are you? Special Olympics um, Manitoba and Canada and the world mm -hmm. um, is an organization that is a, a sport organization that includes people with uh, cognitive disabilities, so people who maybe have low uh, IQ, uh, who also have uh, maybe Down syndrome or autism or Bilocal mm. syndrome and various global developmental delays. Oh, so we're an organization okay. worldwide that mm. helps uh, athletes to better themselves through sport. So what we what we're doing here today is promoting Westman. Oh, so okay. uh, the lady that was with me and I we mm. uh, we are involved with Special Olympics. Manitoba West Man region, and we uh, I coach at Purdue Sports in Brandon, and she helps me. And uh, we're trying to uh, move out of Brandon into the other communities so that oh, okay. sport happens in each community mm -hmm, mm -hmm. very easily. Sports like golf, uh, soccer, basketball, snowshoe, mm -hmm. skiing. Figure skating. Yeah, yeah. There's so many sports involved, especially mm. mixing. And lots of them, and bocce, bocce ball can happen outdoors. Oh, okay. Sports, um, we just need people to, to say that there's people involved and we need volunteers. Mm. And we're here specifically tonight looking for a, vol a volunteer to oh, coach okay. five pin bowling in Minnedosa. So there's a coach in Minnedosa oh. that does do it. Mm. But we're asking if there's somebody from Nipua that can help. Mm athletes there and coach them. Oh, okay. So we're we're wanting parents and volunteers. We have no programs going here. Mm -hmm. We want to have a conversation. Oh, we want to talk okay. about what we offer, mm -hmm. what can be offered in this great oh, community. Okay. Right? So how about how do you get like the, the the athletes? How do you get the athletes? Yeah. <laughs> well we need to have a conversation with, with the community members. Oh, okay. And we need to say there was a, a few years ago there was a, a, a gathering but it, it didn't really go anywhere mm. and some leadership have changed we want to look at it again and invite people you know we want to mm. do programs that include uh, athletes who may struggle getting into the community things they, they may be shy they may be they have oh, autism okay. they don't know how to get through this is the venue to do so you, you support uh, existing athletes who has uh, Different disabilities, different. challenges. Dis okay, challenges. You know, life okay. Is really, really challenging. And mm -hmm. if you don't know how to navigate things in, in your world, if your brain is works a little differently, we mm -hmm. we want to be able to. We know that there's athletes out yeah. there that want to participate. Oh, you know, we just okay. had a mom come in and say, "I heard you guys are coming." Here. Uh -huh. Well, we're hoping to come, mm -hmm. but we're here to look for athletes and volunteers and coaches oh, okay. in order for something to happen. We need the community to say, I'll coach. Oh, okay. I'll come and help. I'll mm. program do the program assisting. Mm, okay. We'll need a, we need facilities. Mm -hmm. you know, we're a nonprofit organization. Okay, okay. We have a lot of athletes out in the 80s areas. We just need to to be here and show them. <laughs> Special Olympics movement is a fabulous movement. You know, yeah, the, yeah. The ability for athletes to mm -hmm. participate mm -hmm. and if they want 
to compete. Oh, okay. I've mm -hmm. taken two teams to national level competitions wow. and, and won one and, and lost in the final of soccer. It has been the best times of their lives. We're not, we're not guaranteeing that, but we're mm -hmm. guaranteeing an opportunity for people to come mm -hmm. and participate. Oh, okay. So for now, for, for what kind of support do you provide them? Like, uh, like for like for other areas? So do you what, have? For the reason, so we talked to, with a, a person here that if somebody wants to start a program, we will oh, help get okay. that program going. We'll help get all of the like the registration figured out, oh. uh, programming, uh, assistance for money if needed. Oh, okay. uh, and so there's like. There's registration that needs to happen, both coaches and athletes, mm -hmm. and the registration fee. So that covers like you know any any um, legalities, and oh, buildings, okay. and, and that we have to we have to rent. But we will support any program that starts. So it depends really on the the needs of the community, right? Like we yeah. need the community to say yeah. what they what need. They need. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know, I understand, and and uh, there's a lot of. Uh, as I was driving here, I heard Mr. Wamsley talk about what was going on in the community immigration stuff. Mm. And I know the Filipinos like the, put the basketball, so <laughs> I know there's some people. I know there's people out there within within the, the community here yeah. that mm. would benefit from our program. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. And if there's any questions, you know, there's information and we'll help answer any questions. And if we don't have the answers, we'll ask our provincial chapter to help us with that. Oh, okay. Okay. We want athletes to come. They can't, if they're not necessarily fitting into other uh, other programs, we're here. Okay. And there's a program that may even get started where they where we unify both athletes with some cognitive challenges mm. with athletes that can help them learn along the way. Oh, okay. So it's called a unified program. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's a program started by uh, Special Olympics uh, National and, and World Movement. So mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, thank you so much You're for welcome. your time. We're here with Ali from uh, Nipoa Co-op. So, Ali, can you tell us something what you have here today for the fall registration? <laughs> We're here with Nipoa Gladstone Co-op Kids Club. So it's a free group for all kids 12 and under to join. And by joining the Co-op Kids Club, they get coupons mailed out for their birthday as well as invites to special events. So we have a drive-in movie happening in Gladstone on September 11th. We have a Halloween party happening in Nipawa in October, and we'll be alternating between Nipawa and Gladstone or doing them in both towns to keep it available for everybody. Mm -hmm. And you can sign up on our website, or you can also keep an eye on our Facebook page, Nipawa Gladstone Co-op, for updates about the events, as well as links to our website to sign up on there. And it's free for all kids 12 and under to join. You don't have to be a Co-op member to mm -hmm. sign your kids up. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much, Ali. Thank you. <laughs> so we're great. Dark group. 
So, Arnel, can you tell us something about the group that you have? Yeah, uh, hi, uh, good afternoon to everyone. Uh, uh, Nipawa Dark uh, group uh, is a group of uh, individuals who uh, love to play darts. Mm -hmm. uh, me uh, personally and my family uh, used to play this in the Philippines uh, professionally mm -hmm. and uh, just for fun. Uh, especially in our uh, in Canada, in our town, uh, in winter, uh, uh, most of the sports are not available uh, for everybody. So, uh, in darts, uh, it's uh, very easy to play. Mm -hmm. uh, you can play individually in the house, and uh, you can play online mm -hmm. uh, with other uh, people. Mm -hmm. So, like start, uh, we started uh, our uh, group uh, just this year, but uh, I started playing. Uh, when I arrived here in Canada, like in 2020, 2020. so uh, just uh, me and uh, Joseph Kalesa mm -hmm. were the only uh, from Nipawa uh, playing uh, professionally in uh, Winnipeg. Winnipeg, yeah. So yeah. <laughs> after two years, uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, people are interested to play, mm -hmm. and uh, I know uh, here in our town. Especially Filipinos, uh, they're very good in darts mm -hmm. uh, because uh, darts is like uh, uh, very famous in our country. Mm -hmm. So yeah. we're hoping that uh, we can uh, uh, get some youth to mm -hmm. participate. Mm -hmm. So right now, uh, uh, last year, uh, Manitoba province has no representative. Uh, to play in the nationals mm. uh, in Toronto, so uh, we're uh, like uh, like uh, wondering uh, why uh, we need uh, eight uh, women and uh, eight uh, men and the singles uh, mm. for the youth. For so the youth, yeah. if you qualify for the provincials, if you qualify for the nationals, mm -hmm. it would be uh, an all expense uh, free mm -hmm. for them and. Uh, uh, right now, uh, we're trying to train uh, youth here in our town uh, to represent our province. Yeah, okay. okay. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. So how they, can they contact you if they want yeah, uh, to? So, uh, what we are uh, like uh, uh, planning to uh, have a training uh, every uh, Sunday or uh, Depends on the schedule. Uh, we're gonna be having our training at Legion mm -hmm. uh, Sunday morning. So like uh, an hour or two hours of uh, dart practice. Mm -hmm. And uh, what we are promoting right now is uh, playing uh, online. Uh, mm -hmm. this so we can play online uh, just in our house. Uh, uh, using our phone, so mm -hmm. uh, we can uh, create a game and uh, it's a live game. So mm -hmm. no need to go out, especially in winter. Mm -hmm. So the kids are just in the house and uh, they can play darts uh, with their friends and uh, other uh, 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 players too. Mm, okay, so okay. this is uh, one of our play players, right? Luigi and Fish Kisha. The men's and the Luis Kisha and the ladies. Mm -hmm. uh, so, like uh, them are there uh, already started training right now, and then mm -hmm. uh, hoping uh, uh, this coming uh, September or October uh, for the provincial qualifier, mm -hmm. so they could qualify. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, we're gonna train. Until uh, they could uh, reach to nationals. To nationals. Well, year. that's great. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm encouraging all the youth out there uh, to, if you want to learn how to play darts, and mm -hmm. uh, uh, you could uh, like uh, represent our uh, province to the nationals uh, yeah. with this sport. Mm -hmm. So okay. uh, just uh, give me a call. Uh, What's your contact number so they can? <laughs> yeah, my contact number is uh, 431 mm -hmm. and uh, you can uh, follow me on uh, Facebook, Arnel Munda. Mm, okay. uh, right now, uh, I'm uh, currently uh, ranked number 11 and the uh, men's singles in the whole Manitoba province. Mm -hmm. So that's why uh, 
I used to play uh, in a, uh, every competition here in uh, Manitoba. <laughs> and hopefully it could represent uh, our province next year uh, in Quebec, uh, okay. wow. Canada. Okay. So, yes. cheers yes. guys. Yeah. Uh, Luigi, what? Uh, so what do you say about our youth? Um, about the youth, it's helped me to focus on everything or um, doing things. And by teaching, my, my coach teach me how to focus on that game. And, mm -hmm. um, and my parents were supporting me too yeah. on doing darts. Mm -hmm. Because okay. by doing darts, I've been disciplined by my coach because um, my <laughs> because my parents were surprised because yeah. I've been a like um, hard-headed in our house, but when I joined darts, I've been like changed by the darts. Mm -hmm. That's okay. why. Yeah. 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 Thanks, man. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. That's by the way, to know. Uh, yeah. uh, belongs to uh, uh, special. Children, mm, so okay. he's an ADHD mm. and so hyper intensive. Mm. So his parents are uh, very lucky that uh, uh, Luigi uh, learned how to play darts. Darts, so, wow, that's good. Uh, everybody is welcome here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you so much, Arnel.